Welcome back, guys, to Trails into Reverie, where last episode, where the fourth stratum opened, we mixed up our crossbell patrol by heading into the Reverie Garden, starting to talk to all our allies within, who now could retain their memories from the outside. We also played four more matches of Pom Pom Party, as we now finish the Garden Sweep before heading into the Reverie Corridor. I bet we could fish here. Is there a new one, though? <laughs> Bye. Well, that's a small one. It's a small, big, blooming shark. Small. Look at the size of this baby. Big ass shark. Glutton shark. I, I'm 100% sure that's new. Goodbye. Oh. Oh, crap. What's it me? That was a massive shark. Bye. This will be good. The spiky fish just came in. Look at the size of this baby. People reporting getting boundless trails in their possession. Nice, nice. <laughs> Bye. Because we needed more trails, right, guys? <laughs> this will be good. Trails of another name. Hopefully you find the game nice and easy. It's yeah. a nice catch. We're going to be let's playing it as of now after all. <laughs> Having fun, fun, fun. All right, uh, we've talked to everyone here. We got the fish there. Let's continue to talk. Victor. Supposedly, this is not a, uh, a nice social talking distance. I have to be, like, grabbing you. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Have a hug. I will lead our way to victory. Repair work on damage that the Courageous 2 sustained and not proceed to the brisk pace. However, due to the restraints put in place by Calvert, we can't fly into Crossbow like we were able to with the Imperial Fortress. That would have been a real help, but I understand. We'll make do somehow. Do not be discouraged. Remember, Crossbow is where the Lance Maiden was laid to rest. As head of the Arsade family, I cannot ignore a calamity that threatens the peace and well-being of your homeland. But now let us do our utmost to prepare for what is to come. I swear by my sword and spirit, I shall lend you my aid. It's incredibly reassuring to hear you have our back, Radiant Blade Master, sir. Thank you so much. I think we thought the Watchtower was nothing like the real deal. Facing a swordsman of your calibers, Master of the Eight Leaf's second form is invaluable. Yeah, I suspect Dream will surpass me eventually. You both should be proud of the next generation of swordsmen inheriting Erebonia's two signature styles. Continue to aim for greater heights. There's still several role models I wish to surpass. I'll make sure to use the trials here and in the real world as further experience. Right. Which is why we'd like to continue training with the Divine Blade of Wind. It's a deal, as long as I can continue to learn from the two of you as well. They're training ahead of the final battle. I probably shouldn't interrupt them. For the Vander name. Interrupting continues. It's fascinating to see how each eight leaves one blade practitioner puts different thought and will into their respective styles. I thought the same thing in the tournament. It put it into perspective how greatly fighting styles can differ across the continent. I feel I must refine my own style before the coming battles. I want my will to protect those closest to me to be reflected in my blades. Hey, what's new? There are still many out there I have yet to surpass. People like Erinrod, who I adore as a little girl, and General Le Guin. That's what makes the Path of the Sword worthwhile. The challenges are formidable, as is the reward of overcoming them. But if I'm to reach new heights, I must first surpass her, my counterpart that we engaged in the Castle of Mirrors. May we forge a fine path ahead. I've never been interested in pursuing the title of being the strongest, but I do believe it healthy to face new challenges to keep oneself from growing stagnant. No doubt the younger swordsman will help me discover quite a few new ways of owning my craft. How much I'll be able to them in turn, how much I'll be able them in turn, I don't know. But I'll be here to support them should they need me. <laughs> There's too many swords, I can't escape. Sword cordon. So this world is meant to act as a training ground to help us solve what's happening in Crossbell. What's strange to me is that I should be in Erebonia right now in the real world. Even if I were to train here myself, I don't know how I would be able to directly affect the situation in Crossbell. That's a good point. There are others here who shouldn't be able to directly participate in what's happening either. There may be something more to this then. Something we still haven't figured out. Though I don't think there's anything strange about all of us working together right now. Given the situation, I assume you'd be working alongside the princess. Oh, you're right. I would have loved to have been by Reen's side to help him as well. But right now I focus on what I can what I can control and do while still in the Empire. Gotcha. You don't have to worry about Instructor Reen. I'll see to it that he's safe and sound. Let's work together in here to become stronger, even if we are separated in reality. 
Absolutely. Good point, girls. Good point. Why is everyone here when they're not even present for what we're doing? Why are they training if they're not actually needed? Yes? Is something the matter? I never thought we'd come together with all these people from faraway places and fight as one group. Still, it's reassuring to have them here. It gives me extra strength. Whatever it takes, we'll get to the bottom of what's going on. Together. As a team. I hope all is well. I may not be able to help with the operation directly, but you can be sure I'll do everything I can in Erebonia. All I ask is that you make sure my brother and the rest of Class 7 stay safe. Please. Now then. Let's move forward together. I'm still trying to find my bearings here, truth be told, but at least I have Elise and Muse to lean on. I too have been summoned personally for a reason, however, so I intend to do my part. That means I'm at your command. No worrying about my rank here. Whatever you need of me, I'm pleased to be of service. It's uh, three more tables to go through. The Retributive Tower's presence is terrifying, isn't it? It's even scary to think how long it's been there without anyone noticing. Professor Schmidt and the others are currently looking to how that happened at the Castle of Mirrors. Regardless, it's clearly a weapon that surpasses anything we've ever seen before, so I should go to the Castle of Mirrors then by the look of it. They're there. We did come across signs of something massive being produced at the Rhineford Military Factory. To put in perspective how massive the tower is, I think only the main weapon was built at the factory. The Divine Lightning, the weapon that wiped out the naval fortress. If that thing is allowed to fire more shots than Crosbell, no, the entire continent will. We're not going to let that happen. We only have half a day in the real world. Normally, I would say it's hopeless. Right, but as long as we're in here, we have as much time as we need to train and prepare ourselves. Well put, everyone. Let's do everything we can to stop the crisis that's unfurling. What if you could just bring out the mirror in the middle of the, the, the final battle and go, I'm not strong enough right now, and you just go heal up, and then you just go train. <laughs> I'd be like, what? And you instantly blip into reality again. I know we can do this. Halvar's new leader, President Gramhart, has already started moving to de-escalate the situation. Crosswell's path to independence may be completely severed, even if he manages to end the conflict. We have to end this ourselves. Now's the time for us to come together. Oh, need anything? It feels surreal to wind up fighting alongside everyone in Crosswell like this. I never could have imagined something like this when I attended the West Samaria Trade Conference a few years ago. You never know where life may lead you, but regardless, I'm going to train hard and repay everything the Crosswellans have taught me. All I know is we have to do something. There's a lot of orbital tech out there that not even the Rhineford Company can manufacture. There's the Retributive Tower and its Divine Lightning, not to mention the Simulacra and those advanced stealth devices too. But we will prevail. We have to. The pride of our company and my entire family is at stake here. Two tables remain. So what's up, kid? You went out of your way to drag us here, so spit it out. Please stop it with the kid thing. There's just something I wanted to ask. How are you two okay with involving the people you care about in this coming fight? the hell are you stupid? Not quite the words I would have chosen, but I do believe there's been a misunderstanding. For one, your assumption that we involve them is incorrect. That isn't why Millian fights besides us anyway. She chose this path for herself. That's all there is to it, and all it will ever be. What? <laughs> it's the same way with Tita. She knows what she's doing. I don't even have to tell her I'll protect her these days. Tita can handle herself. Look, I get where you're coming from, but maybe try taking a look in the mirror. What do you mean? We can't pretend to know your past, nor do either of us plan to force it out of you. Maybe the answer you're looking for lies within yourself. Have you considered having more faith in yourself and your partner? I... Hard to believe Swin and Nadia are still only around 14 years old. They have a lot weighing on them. This is the moment of truth. Sheesh, you stopped me for that. Up. But it's cool. You're supposed to overthink things here, H. Come to the territory and it's how you grow into being an adult. While we're in here, I'm going to do my part to whip you into shape. For people like us, this is nothing at now all. Now the fake has been dealt with, everything else can wait for it after we've taken care of that tower. There will be much to discuss once this is all over. That end, I need to see to it that Milliam, Reen, Regnitz, and I make it through this. Well, uh... What do I want to do from lot, here on huh? out? It's a good question. Wish I could look at the big picture like the others. Maybe not being able to is a sign I've got some growing up to do. But now I'd rather put my focus on getting through the weirdness here in front of us. The only thing I can say for sure about the future is that I'll never stop protecting Nadia. Retributive Tower is unlike anything I've ever seen before. You don't know anything more about it, do you, do really? We got the old enforcer table. I don't. McBurn's simulacrum was the product of the sixth anguish acting alone. Ouroboros was involved at some level, but I couldn't say how much. So it's not unlike the Azure Tree incident, the key difference being that we still don't know who the mastermind behind this is. That Grizzly Grim fellow said whoever it is has taken over Elysium. It doesn't sit well with me that they also took over the Rhineford military factory and misappropriated materials to build the tower. Regardless of who or what is behind this, I plan to give them their proper comeuppance alongside Lady Elisa and the others. 
You've really found a place where you belong, haven't you, Sharon? I think it's fair to say we've all changed a lot since leaving Ouroboros. What about you, Swift? Have you considered taking the opportunity to leave as well? You've been going through a lot in this last year. I can't deny that, but I have a responsibility to look, to look after the Star Ritter. That is what my lord would want. Maybe you haven't changed after all. Yes, but that part of her has always been part of her charm. How's it going? Croswell isn't the only one in danger now. It's only a matter of time before the bill is in the line of fire if that tower is left alone. This calls for us pulling together yet again to pr protect our homes, doesn't it? History says we make a pretty good team, Lloyd. You can count on me, Estelle, and the others to fight our hardest when the time comes. I wouldn't expect anything less from you all. Let's do whatever it takes to resolve this. Hello. How are you doing? That tower showed up at the worst possible time. I wouldn't be surprised if it's caught the professor's interest. It's safe to say we're in for the tea party of the ages, if you catch my drift. People important to me call Crossbell home. Rest assured that I intend to give it my all. I'm ready to do whatever you ask. Now that I'm free of any lingering doubts in the wake of the Great Twilight, I am now solely a maid for the Rhineford Company. I now fully walk together with Lady Elisa and the rest of you so that I may live out this path that I've carved for myself. Oh, there's more people to speak to you about there. If you could keep it short. I have no intention of joining your lot all these deserters as a comrade. There are simple debts I owe to Schwarzer and the people of Crossbell, as well as the deal I struck with Alborea. More importantly, this is what my lord would have wanted. It's just the thing to do. It's the just thing to do, even. So remember this well. I will lend you my aid just this once. Thanks. You two, back here in a powwow. Protagonist chat. Hey, Reen, Rufus. I'm glad he managed to settle things with that imposter. We were just talking about that. He was probably the primary cause behind all of the chaos. All I did was pick up the remains. Nothing more than the end result of everyone else rising up to take action. That being said, the voice we've been hearing is even more logical than I realized. Why return our memories? Wouldn't people such as yourself, Detective or Yusuf, be more cooperative if you didn't have your memories of me? Where's this coming from, Rufus? Yeah, really, I don't think that's true at all. If anything, I think having our memories back makes it easier to work with you. Does it now? He's not wrong. I'm sure Yusuf feels the same way. We count on your help to fix what's happening in reality. I have no objections. Solving that crisis is merely an extension of taking responsibility for the mess I made. I couldn't tell you what may await us, but until we found our answer, I'm more than willing to continue working together. Can I help you? Whether we like it or not, our fates are determined to stay intertwined with one another's. I doubt there will ever be a better chance to settle the score with me, so why not do so? Well, I'd be lying if I said I didn't want to, in a way, yeah. But also don't like the idea of fighting you head on when what's done is done, either. Fair enough. Then I propose we work out our issues with a few rounds of Vantage Masters. Would that be more to your taste? Ah, uh, that's an interesting idea. Sure, why not? I just wasn't thinking a nobleman would whip out a card game as a way to resolve a dispute. The credit isn't mine, to be fair. The other Iron Blood suggested I started playing. After some matches, I realized it was a certain strategic depth on par with real combat. That being the case, I should think it's a fine way to resolve our differences. Uh, yeah, you sound genuine enough about it, too, so I'm in. Not sure if my deck has what it takes. I need to beef up my collection before I can put up a real fight. Do you think you could give me some time to prepare before we go at it? If we're going to play, I want to be sure I give you everything I've got. Of course, take all the time you need. I'll be here till you're ready. Are you the final... Is he the final mission? I mean, just saying new one was in there. Win against 31 people at the Pom Pom Party Sporting Stone. We've got the final eight there, yeah. I mean, unfortunately, everything's sorted by progress at the moment. We have to powerful weapon using Black Zamurian ore? Ho 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 ho! Winning against Rufus in VM in the Reverie Garden for a true revolution. Chief C rank C or higher on course A for the banana boat at the beach? <laughs> what the hell? Can I help you? Some of you are much too quick to give the irredeemable redemption, you know. Not that I'm complaining, far from it. It's proven to be very convenient for me. May we make great use of one another till we get to the bottom of our current predicament. Right, I suppose the most we can expect out of each other, so let's make it work. All that's left is to overcome this together. We may all live and work in different parts of the world, but we've all thrown our weight behind achieving the same underlying goals. And now that we're all together in one place, there's no reason we can't overcome any hurdles that stand in our way. If our combined strength with Rufus's too, I'm confident we can make it through this, Lloyd. Definitely. It's good to be working together again, Reen. And that is everyone spoken to. We did it. Trading process. I don't even have you material to really trade for stuff at the moment. Any good curios? Sobler and Tira? 
I'm interested to see what buying equipment is. So it's the same stuff we were seeing before. So I'm assuming there's no more visitor access detected. Upgrades that can be done. Akatsuki. Oh, Black Samurai and all. And we can see it beforehand too. Magical Endomion. Emma only. ATS plus 215. Celine's nails. <laughs> what the hell? That's critical rate up. The critical rate up actually works quite well for her. Zealous wins. My god. Bulmung. They got lots of stuff, haven't they? Soul Breaker. Pale Acolyte. Critical rate as well. The critical rate plus the ATS there is pretty tasty. Savage Small. Critical rate ATS and strength. Mm. 1605 too. Right, we're in, we're in that phase of the game. Okay. So, into the Reverie Corridor we go at last. We talk to everyone. In Crosswell City, we talked to everyone in the Reverie Garden. I That's a lie. Because, of course, we know we're probably going to get more gold stones, and that's going to sort that out. We've got our preferred squad, I guess. But to be honest, for the actual more exploration side of it, it's more... If, more The more physical users we have, kind of like the better, I feel. I don't know how much... Uh, we'll switch in and out as we go. What are we here? Right. Bob Stratum, here I come. We got more zappy floors. The sooner we do this, oh, the sooner I can nap. Got my music again. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, we can't actually do anything with that apart from rest. This area's. What are we looking at here? Is it seal? So now we want cancers instead? Great. It's the seal floor. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Is that like what I think it is? There! Here's our shot! Is it seal? It is seal. <laughs> so everyone is sealed. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> what a great start. <laughs> uh. Can we just do that to cure all our stuff? Are they gonna work? I mean, I can recur you too. It's like recur you and then launch a, a bigger attack. I mean, you probably need to scan these too. Might miss these at this rate. We've got S crafts though. A dazzly fluff that hides behind stronger companions, bringing joy and goodies to those who catch it. All right. Fortunately, you're not just faster than anyone here. Lost Genesis. Now Cross Crusader will be fine. Uh, no, Cross Crusader ain't even that good. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, Fee. Let's go. I have to kill these things, though. Break them! Raging hammer! Well, if all in there, really, I'm just gonna launch. Uh... Reen to smash them. Zero breaker! But they should all break. Huh? And now I've got turns. My turn. So no matter what, we had an alternate option. Cut through. I did it with right. what we had. Nice work, team. The thing is, I could just launch Green's S craft, and that would also clear everything out. Rush two between Lloyd and Green. So I might just have to wander into enemies and use UF stuff instead. Which, to be fair, I do need to use. Can I turn this off? Oh, it's that. Can we turn off this floor, okay, please? Gang, I hate we've it. Got a way through now. Lovely. B -b 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 Holy breath. 
I'm sure this has its uses. I've only seen it like a billion <laughs> times. I'm Ready. sure you have no clue what its uses are. I'm curious to see what's in that chest myself. It's a marble bracelet with ATS plus 45. What's that big shiny dude? Bear. That looks strong. Stay alert. Oh yeah, we can't do that. Bear. Now's our chance. Let's kill these dudes first then. All yours. I'll handle the rest. Analyzing enemy unit. Analysis complete. This is Nyalo Fep. Nyalo Fotep. <laughs> yeah, sure. A uh, mysterious invader from other outer space. <laughs> Made of any matter, it destroys everything it comes in contact with, which sounds horrible. I'm up. Break them. Raging hammer. Let's go. I prefer that not to take place, so. Kane down. We'll read them. They are all achy breaky. I'm next. Now. There. Let's well, go. No finisher that comes off on that one. I'm going. Nice critical. Yeah. A chance. Reams with Emma. Got him. Next. A very <laughs> ATS resistance yeah. by the look of it. Red eliminated. Finally. Lloyd and Fees reached link level four. Which is probably why he needed to get that kill. <laughs> the Bwam horn has gone off. Right then, what are you going to do to me? That's what I'm worried about the most. Step up our game for this one. Okay, so you come with the. Uh, oh, you've started casting. Uh, Fee will impede. Crow will buff. Works for me. Break them! Raging hammer! Oh, yeah, you've got Chain Spirit Unification now. So I forgot about that. Uh, chain Spirit Unification! Let's go! Gorman Ghast. Take this, Colonel Gale! Ha! It's down! Heavy first Attack. hit damage. Moving out. We're still alive. As your Extra destiny, strength. by the way, puts me on the zero. Third. So that's going right. to work out well for me. Uh. Oh, wow. You're that element too? Ah, suck it. That's the break. <laughs> I'm next. I mean, it's that. <laughs> that's just. I, I don't. Why's the highest I've hit for a spell? Okay, that was nice. Six figures. I'll take that. Slay on sight. Criminals raid. Got you. Now! I need to scan it! Wide open! <laughs> My god, Crow's right. just going in! You think Soul Blur will be enough? Uh. Alright! Analyzing enemy unit! Well, it died. Crow killed it. Analysis complete! A spirit bearing a cursed grudge, it possesses the living to sate itself with revenge! Yeah. Oh, Crow can go again now. Oh, not enough! Right. Good lost Genesis is again, but it's yeah. really not needed. Go goes again. That's what I was expecting, Crow. You messed with the wrong guy. 100k. I have no clue what that guy does because he died. <laughs> Very fast. I've done it! We're getting level four silver shards now. What ceiling stone are we getting? It's a gold! You've discovered a new character. I mean, I'm only on the first floor, so I may as well just go do it.
I'll leave that. Oh man, not Domino. What the hell? Very smooth. There. Got a hot table here. Lilith Dominoes. What you weakest do, buddies? I mean, Crow's got this, and it puts delay on you, so... You're actually quite resistant to that, sadly. I mean, Diamond Nova you're weak to. We could just do that. Break them! Raging Hammer! At this point, he doesn't have his big buff apart, you know. I'm next. Uh, fair bit of damage, plus you know, an extra break too. I'm, I'm, I, I think that's tasty. Wiping out. The most now. annoying thing is we need some of them to live. Wide open for a little bit longer. I'm up. I can't kill them. I need to let them live. Roar. I need to scan one. Oh. Helix strike. It's down. I don't think I'm used to those numbers out of anything like S-Crafts, you know what I mean? Analyzing it was very surprising unit. when that happened. I see now. A seven-time monster that lurks in the corridor. Its magic crystal granting infinite mana easily rends impudent foes to ash. Now that one hasn't been taking the damage that the other ones have. Slay on sight. Criminals raid. Time to show up. And unfortunately, it kind of falls into the spell categories where I'm not strongest in. But if I can hit a diamond over before, then that's probably uh, job done. I'm next. We're just focusing everything on you. Now. Got him. It's my turn. Yeah, but I'll be a wolf. Uh. Oh, critical. I'll restore you. Thanks. Showtime. Wants to go again fairly oh. fast, doesn't it? Yeah. Now. Got him. Well, looks like Moving melee out. will do it, which is fine by me, actually. Uh. I'm off. Flat thighs for Crow. Ha. That's the power of the eight leaves. MN Fee reached League level four. Ha. Okay, the annoying Seely floor ha. is back. That makes it sound like I'm hating on C. Lee, if you know what I mean. So somehow I found the actual route there and didn't take the right that I needed to. So we might be using UFs on the next few monsters. Die! <laughs> <laughs> Die, weird Mr. Roboto. They okay, actually don't die now that I think about it. And one one Let's go, everyone! <laughs> Stop dying! Excellent work, everyone. We did it. Oh, we got a UF finish. Cool. You died too fast, though. I need to scan you. Thought was gonna hit him then. Alright, we have managed to organize 50 united fronts for all elemental sepith. And not too many phantasmal shards, to be fair. Wonder who would put that chest there. Trial key six. Shadow leggings plus free. I'll be taking that then. Here's the issue. We of course already bought this. Oh no, wait no, we bought the two. So they're better than the threes. <laughs> Okay, so now we really need you materials to get upgrades or to bring characters that we didn't upgrade with stuff to get gear. Otherwise, they're not getting gear. But you can dismantle these, right? When you think about it. This will come in handy. Sapphic ring. There! This one's strong. Be careful. 
Let's say, how about just no one die? <laughs> I could just do two scans and then a UF. <laughs> That's an option for us, I guess. Huh. An evil demon that arose from the primordial sea it consumes life to become a source of energy for the next world to come is Karaskula. I mean, he's got to ancient dockers, eh? <laughs> nice name. A bipedal archaism that wreaks havoc on the battlefield with its lengthy leaps. Its lasers can petrify its targets. Time They're show actually up. horribly bad, and I don't want to fight them. Break them! Raging hammer! All right. To be honest, I could have probably gone harder with that. All for one, and, and one for all. all! Okay, all together now! Hey. <laughs> This guy has actually lived. Arcus, activate. Showtime. Not comfortable with this, but to be honest, I've got all my other stuff now, so I should be able to hit the break. We've got seal, we've got blind. Done. I'm up. There's the break we could have expected. Roar! Healing strike! It's down! It's mine! I think uh, Emma's got enough damage? Yeah. Maybe if I change the crit. I should really look about changing your second course to something that gives crit bonus damage. It feels like that's the the way to play. I got your back! <laughs> Thank you! A la Crow hitting 100k. Alright! Did he even crit that time? Uh. There! We managed to pull through. Yeah, really couldn't have gone better, huh? Be an Ellie level up. Link level four between Crow and Fee. Be in Rufus too. Fee and Nadia. I guess Fee hasn't really been with everyone that well. I've done it. And a silver stone, right? Well, look at it. We have cleared the floor, but we kind of lack some stuff. We only got one ceiling stone. So let's go find out what we got. The first floor is done. Only was it like five, six, seven? More to go, yeah, yeah. When you count in, like, the, uh... A Dreamland Hills! What character are we getting? Gotta catch them all. I may as well touch the tree, too. 